Investigators are still trying to figure out the cause of that building collapse Sunday in Pigtown. Fox 45 has uncovered that days before the three story home crumbled to the ground, several complaints were made to 311. Joseph Ojo reports some are accusing the city of ignoring complaints from residents. Around 8.30 Sunday morning, what once stood as a vacant building along the 1000 block of West Cross Street turned into scattered debris and rubble. One of the roofs was sagging in, one of the walls was sagging out towards the street. It was very clear that the building was not structurally sound. Citizens of Picktown Vice President Deontay Edwards says the building has long been an eyesore and a hazard to public safety. Two requests were made on December 12th and the city responded to those requests by inspecting the property, but did no follow up. Fox 45 News checked the city's 311 website and found that the building was in fact reported for having structural deficiencies. And the most recent complaint was made a day before the collapse. To see the city just ignore us, to be indifferent to the things that are happening here, it's unacceptable. We can't tolerate it anymore. What we found is that some of the requests made were closed by the city. So we asked the city why nothing was done, why were the owners of the building not held accountable, and if Sunday's collapse could have been prevented. So far, we are still waiting for a response. They need to demolish these unsafe structures or otherwise make them sound because we can't continue to live in danger. Fire officials say no one was injured as a result of the collapse, but residents in the area want the city to take over ownership of the property and turn it to a community center. And I did reach out to Mayor Brandon Scott's office and Councilwoman Porter for a response. I'm still waiting to hear back. Joseph Ojo, Fox 45 News.